Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another video for you guys here today. Let's go ahead and do a quick little wave for you guys. Hey, how you doing? Are you ready? Today is going to be a day we are going to go and get that final artifact out of the cave. That's right. I have been preparing. I have so much gear. I am, I am, I am ready. I am ready. I am ready to take on this experience uh we have this guy here in front of us now for those of you that uh, don't follow my streams uh i was able to breed this guy off of uh, my thylas that i was doing uh he is absolutely gorgeous i'm calling him red leader but yeah just a beautiful beautiful red color on this one if we come inside here we can see um it was it wasn't that high level if I'm not mistaken, if I go ahead and click on Thylas uh, and go to my library, um, uh, where's the Thylas? There's the Thylas. There we go. Let's see. Yeah, red one. Uh, yeah, it wasn't that high of a level. But yeah, it's still not bad by any stretch of the imagination. Um, if we come in here, you can see I got a bunch more Thylas that I've been kind of taming and messing with. But um, then I realized during my stream that somebody said that climbers can't go into the, the pit. So that sucks. That sucks a lot. Uh, so I started breeding the Deodons. And as you can see, we've got a small army of Deodons over here, uh, which is pretty good. <laughs> if, if you ask my opinion, a small army of Deodons. We have the, the mom and dad back here. And then uh, we're going to get all of these to come with us here today because we are going to go out into the wilderness. We're going to work our way to that last cave. But with that, we're going to go and take these guys out and level them because I want to see how a bunch of Deodons will do against the Manticore. And I'm also very curious um, with these guys if I can get some T-Rexes or maybe another UD. I would love to as well. I don't know how um, how that's going to work out for our plans, but I think it should work out okay. But uh, we're just going to continue here. Come on, fellas. Is that everybody out of the room? I think that's everybody out of the room. Awesome, except for the last two. Perfect. So let's go ahead and grab my red Thyla. And we are going to get started here. Let me. Uh, I just had to adjust something here real quick. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go right now. Got that one, got that one, got that one, got that one. Should almost be all of them. Or is that all of them? Yeah, I think that's all of them. Oh my goodness, look at all of the Deodons. There's one, two, three, four, five, there's seven Deodons right there. And I've actually got two more around. Um, they just, um, yeah, they, they aren't grown up all the way yet, but look at them come off that cliff. Oh yes. I love it. I love it. All right. So we're going to go out. We're going to fight some death worms. We're going to fight some other stuff and we're going to work our way down. I want to say it's down to the, um, lower left of us. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, where the ruins are for that last cave. All right, so we are here where I believe the cave is. I think it's just inside this building. Let's go ahead and let the Deodons do a little attack pattern. Delta. Get that Arthropleura. Oh, that thing was only level 5. Let's go get that one. Go get it, boys. And then we're going to have them get the other one there, too. There you go. Now, I haven't run across any death worms yet, so I figured I would uh, go ahead and send these guys. Or I, I'm going to go inside the cave because I don't think I can take any of the bigger guys in. But um, why don't I do this? Why don't I get everyone on here except for you? So everyone's following uh, Porco there. And then we can... Oh, I guess... I mean, I probably can't take the Thylacolio into this building. I really don't think that you can. But let's find out if that is a reality. Yeah, I thought it was a, a real little entrance like that. I didn't think... Yeah. Mm -mm. Nope. Okay. So, what we're going to do is I'll just park the Thyla out here. I'm going to go ahead and um, take three of those... 
my canteen is uh, fairly full. I'm going to grab another canteen. I'm going to grab the rest of the automatic rifle bullets and those. And let's go ahead and take a peek inside. Um, I don't have any plans just yet. Let's go ahead and gamma up here a little bit. Okay, if it gets too bad or if I am not prepared, the goal was to take the Deodons out and have them trained up a good amount. But if I can get this artifact as well, I will gladly take the opportunity to do so. Okay, I don't see anything yet. There's a uh, little doodad right here. Get a nice little experience boost. Okay. Still don't see anything. Yeah, kind of surprised I don't see anything yet. Oh, there's... Got the Titan Boa. All right, get uh, get the gun reloaded. Oh God. Get it, get it, get it. Okay. Got kind of worried there. Let's get that reloaded. Okay, so first little wave is handled. There's a little wave. Don't uh, don't get it twisted here. Nothing really seems to be down there. You know what I just realized is that I don't have any grapples. I didn't plan for any grapples. That was probably dumb. It's another rock golem. I don't, I don't know what's the best way to deal with those rock golems. It's probably like grenade launchers, but okay. It, it went back into the ground. Now there's no way for me to like easily get over here. Is there? Okay. I bet you I could run past this rock golem. What do you guys think? I think I can do it. Just run past him. Get a nice little jump. Okay, got those. We're still good, we're still good. Let's reload this gun. All right, I hear the mantis. Let's keep shooting it. Okay, killed that one. Okay, the Arthur Pluro's gone. Okay, sorry, I'm like, I'm full concentration mode right here. Whew, okay. I didn't bring the flamethrower. I, that was a dumb mistake for me as well. Oh God, his leg was like bent backwards. You see that? Okay, we're down here to the cave. You know what? I don't. I don't. I don't want to be here. My armor's already broken. Um, there's a rock golem there. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. We're just gonna leave, and we're gonna come back later with our full riot gear, grapples, rocket launchers. Yeah, I don't think this is a cave I can do by myself. Maybe even breed like a little baby something something to put in an egg, and then bring the egg over here and and breed it up or maybe bring some thylas over here and breed up the thylas. 
I don't know. I just don't think that I can do this on my own. All right, we're running around the desert looking for... Oh, there's they're attacking stuff up there. Looking for death worms and stuff. I have yet to find one. But these guys are fighting Arthropleuro left, right, and center, which is all right by me, I guess. Killing mantises. Keep going here. Yeah, keep going. Hey, get out of here, stupid thing. But there's a, uh, a a red loot drop over here. Still not seeing any death worms. And I'm a little disappointed in that, to be 100% honest with you. Um, I was hoping that we would. Let's see, polymer. Let's go ahead and drop the polymer. Let's um, drop the chitin. There we go. All we're left with is the mate. Let's see, what are we going to get out of this? You think we're going to get something good? Uh, we get a fur hat and a packy saddle blueprint. A packy saddle. Um, that's all right, I guess. I mean, you know, it's not the greatest, but let's go ahead and pull from the diadons to the thylas. All of the uh, chitin. There we go. And let's pull all the polymer. There we go. Pull. And then we can go ahead and drop the chitin. See, this is what I've been doing is I'm just kind of like pulling all of this stuff from these guys. Actually, let's uh, let's pull hide as well. Dadon to the thyla. Uh, pull. There we go. No, cancel. Uh, yeah, there wasn't actually that much of that. Alright. So just kind of making sure that uh, these guys aren't getting like two way down or anything like that. But I really... Like, my goal is to kill a couple of death worms. Like, that is like my... My ultimate goal here in this journey, like if we go ahead and pull up our map here, we're, we're about halfway around. I'd say a little less than halfway around. We still got uh, all seven. We do. Good. All right. So I just, I want to get a death worm because I think killing a death worm would boost so many of these guys. All right, guys, right up in front here. I think we have a death worm. I don't see it yet. Yep. There it comes. There it comes. There it comes. Um, gonna run this way for a second. I don't want to fight it with my Thyla. I want to see these guys take it on. There it is. There it is. Get it, boys and girls, I guess. Get it. Uh, turn up some, some sound effects here. Doesn't sound like they're doing a whole lot to it. But I'll shoot it with a, a machine gun. They are pushing it. I'll say that much. They are pushing him back. Are death worms boys or girls? Oh, I killed it. Oh, wow. They like ate it very quickly. Uh, excuse me. I would like... I would like you all to come over this way so I can get that loot package. That would be great. Thank you. Uh, yeah, just some angler gel and stuff. All right. It's not a, a lot of stuff. It's nothing real good, but... So how many levels did you guys get? Just one. Uh, just one for you. Just one for you. Just one for you. Doesn't look like anybody took a ton of damage or anything. Baconator, no level up. Yeah, so not a ton of level ups. All right, well, I guess we'll um, we'll keep looking around here. And I'll see if I can't uh, find another couple of these things. And I really do want to get these guys leveled, like, big time. All right, guys. So I went out after I got back. I really couldn't level these guys very much at all. Um, I saw three death worms total, and one of them vanished uh, when I walked up to it. So I wasn't exactly sure what had happened there. Uh, but these guys are semi-leveled up um they they have a, a bit more to go it's like midnight right now and i'm getting super tired so what i'm uh what i decided to do was i decided that i was going to um spend a little bit of time i went and tamed another t-rex it was a 95 female uh tamed with uh 
with prime meat, so it turned out you know fairly good. Get all these guys up to a thousand. I'm starting to boost health on them. Uh, so it, yeah, it tamed out pretty good, and then. I mean, it wasn't great, so pretty good might be a bit of an overstatement. Um, but yeah, uh, we got that. I bred them, and I have the egg in my inventory. You can see it right there uh, with um, incubation of six left, so it's it's got a good ways to go yet. So let's boost some health on that guy right yonder. 27,000 health is pretty darn good. So yeah, let's go ahead and throw these inside next to the air conditioners and breed us up a Rex. I think it uh, shouldn't be too big of a problem. If I put that in my inventory and I select that, I can repair it. Nice. Okay. So yeah, let's go ahead, toss down the egg. There it is. Use our special torch that we have. 21 seconds remaining to uh, get our egg. Now, um, I do believe I cooked up a good amount of meat here, so let's grab it. Turn off the grill. And seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Kerplop. Oh yeah, imprint on the baby Rex. Baby Rex! Oh yeah, there it is. Alright, let's go ahead and put some stuff on it. Man, baby Rexes are still huge. Look at that guy. Look at him. Look at the look at the look in his eye. He just looks devilish, doesn't he? He just looks absolutely devilish. I'm just I'm gonna I'm gonna take a few screenshots here because it's a baby. You gotta take screenshots of the baby. So let's see, any mutations? Oh, we got a muta mutation on this line. Uh, so it's probably a stat mutation if I had to look. Um, I didn't actually write down anything on these guys, um, mainly because I, I didn't like really plan to, to, t uh, to breed these for any particular stats or anything like that. Uh, my, my major goal for the Rex was uh, just to get a bunch of them to take into the Mana Core fight. So um, I was really excited about the Thyla, and I think I am going to continue to breed Thylas uh, for mutations just for my own benefit. Um, and there's another Rex egg over there. But I think as far as um, breeding them for stat mutations and stuff like that. I don't think that's something I'm going to do. Maybe dire wolves, um, maybe, you know, or maybe I'll just wait until I get some, like, really, uh, max level stuff. Uh, stop wandering. Anytime you want to stop wandering, that'll be good. Uh, listen to me, baby Rex. You, you gotta stop wandering. You can't do these things. You're not old enough yet. Come on, come over this way. Come on. You know you want to. Come on over, Baby Rex. Come on, Baby Rex. Be a part of this family. Come on, Baby Rex. You gotta do it for me. All right, well, I guess you're just gonna stay there. That's fine. All right, we're gonna load this guy up. I'm glad we were able to get to that one. It was, uh, it was a... I mean, it wasn't hard. I mean, I've tamed two other Rexes. Um, but, you know, it was just, it's a pain, you know, and especially because it was the 95 was the biggest female that I could find. So it wasn't like anything great. So maybe the Udys, uh, maybe Dire Wolves. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys might want to see as far as like dinos and stuff. Cause I, I am, I am curious. So, all right, guys, thanks so much for watching. I think, uh, here pretty soon we're going to try and either get another Wyvern or we might, uh, get our good armor and stuff, make a last-ditch effort for that last cave, and, um, yeah, I'll probably try for a boss fight here soon with the Deodons. Not sure how it'll go, but, you know, all we can do is try. So, all right, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.